We know healthcare workers have had a difficult year, but the NFL is treating a lucky few to a day at the big game. Jake Jones joins us now with more on who's going to the big game. Well, the stadium won't be full, but Super Bowl 55 will have some very special guests on Sunday. Jack Doles joins us from Tampa with the story of one of the vaccinated healthcare workers who won a ticket to the big game. Jake, whatever you do, don't try and find one of these tickets on the open market because they are not for sale. And John Weiss would not dream of giving up his. On Super Bowl Sunday, John Weiss will do something he's never done before. This will be your first ever Bucks game, is that right? Absolutely. He'll be one of the 7,500 vaccinated healthcare workers that get to watch Super Bowl 55 live from Raymond James Stadium. Even though I've always felt recognized for what I do, it was just extra recognition for what I do. So it was very special that the NFL and Tampa General able to put that together for us. John is an occupational therapist at Tampa General. Since COVID hit, he's been working with recovering COVID patients. People think, oh, it's just a, a flu and only 1% of the population has it. Well, when we're full and we have intensive care units are full and other units are full, I've never seen anything like it before. COVID has added another element to his daily duties, one that is both gratifying and heart-wrenching. It's been tough to see patients who can't have visitors. So you're sick, you're not well, and you're alone. And that has been the hardest part. Because of that, healthcare workers like John are, at times, the closest thing a patient has to family. That's a big burden to shoulder. That life is short. Um, don't take it for granted um, that something like this can come out of nowhere. It just it surprises you. And, and the lesson is that, you know, take every day as if it could be your last day because you just don't know what's out there. John and the other vaccinated health care workers will be wearing special colored N95 masks, so they should be really easy to spot in the crowd. And Jake, if you're watching this game, give them a thumbs up or a hand because they certainly deserve it. Without question there. And uh, again, thanks for all the hard work this week, Jack, and hopefully it's been a lot of fun as well. Well, game day is only a couple days out now, and we'll just have to wait for the highlights.